Can I charge a 1.5 volt AA battery off a powerful 3.7 volt lithium ion using the foil charging hack I showed in my last video? The difference in voltage can send current surging into the AA battery at dangerously high speeds. We're risking overheating, venting, and maybe even fire to show you if this cross voltage hack is worth it in an emergency. I tested two battery types, a 1.5 volt alkaline and a 1.2 volt rechargeable nickel metal hydride. Immediately when I connected either one of these batteries to the lithium ion battery, I get a massive inrush of charge current, over 15 amps. That's a huge <laughs> amount of current, especially for a single use battery. Using batteries that were totally dead actually brought the number down, which is the opposite of what I expected. This is still a risky move, but if I absolutely had to in a life or death scenario, this is the exact method I would use to do it. To prevent the AA battery from taking on too much heat, I would charge in short bursts, setting the batteries up like this, putting the negative contacts of each battery on one strip of foil and holding the positive end on with my fingers. At any point when the AA battery or the foil started getting warm, I stopped and let it completely cool down. Doing this on-off method for a total of 10 minutes gave me the equivalent of 5 minutes charge time, but critically, that controlled charging allowed me to take a dead AA battery and charge it enough to run the flashlight for over an hour before the battery died again. Safety note, I used a lithium ion battery capable of a 30 amp discharge for this test. Using cells of unknown chemistry or capability could be very dangerous, so I wouldn't.